This was a super big saving grace for me as a player. I learned how to create little focus points that help me hone in on specific skills that I needed to work on. And so what this is, and I'll give you an example of, of this as we're talking through this, but have your athletes pick two or three skills that they'd like to improve on. Then let's list about five to six simple yet specific phrases that will help them remember things they need to work on within that skill. So in serving, for example, there's the bounce, there's the toss, there's the body position. Make the details of these focus points really short and sweet. So for example, when I want to work on my serve, I'm talking about my toss. Let's say I want to remember while I'm tossing, I need to toss on my right shoulder or out in front. So those two or three word phrases are going to be my focus points. So the more precise, the better. And then you're going to pick two to three points that you've written down for that skill. And you're going to pick two to three to focus on in practice for a week or three days or whatever it is. But it's up to the athlete. This is just a really great way to break down skill sets and build confidence because you're able to see the results when you're doing this. And so you're giving them tangible goals to achieve daily by giving them this task of writing down focus points. So I'll give you another example. For me as an attacker... There's a lot of things that I felt that I needed to break down within my attacking um, as focus points. So not just, you know, hitting deep in the court. Those aren't things, those are things that I need to work on, but let me kind of break it down even more. So what is another way that I can say hitting deep in the court? So for me, it was hit fingers. So those are, that was a, a focus point that I used. Also, when I wanted to have a better approach to the ball, get my feet all the way to the ball, I said things like, first step, heel to toe. Okay, so even the slightest detail, heel to toe, I was trying to focus on just that during practice, and I saw a difference. So when we break down those skills, we give ourselves those two to three word phrases, then we can quickly remember those things in practice and we'll definitely see the results and that's a huge confidence builder.